Hello friends, welcome to Maths Vlogs. Today let us solve question number 2 of exercise 4.4. Solve the following. A part, the teacher tells the class that the highest marks obtained by a student in her class is twice the lowest marks plus 7. The highest score is 87. What is the lowest score? So, lowest score, let us take lowest score as x. So, twice the lowest score plus 7 is the highest score. So, 2x plus 7 is equal to 87. Now, first we will transpose 7 to RHS. So, we will get 80. 2x equal to 80. Now, we will divide both sides by 2. So, we will get x is equal to 40. That is the lowest score. B part in an isosceles triangle the base angles are equal. The vertex angle is 40 degree. What are the base angles of the triangle? Now here remember that the sum of three angles of triangle is 180. So let us take the uh, base angle as x. So two base angles 2x plus vertex angle 40 is equal to 180. So let us solve this. Let the base angle be x. So what will be the sum 2x plus vertex angle is 40 degree. So 40 is equal to 180. Now we will transpose 40. So, 2x is equal to 180 minus 40. So, we get 2x is equal to 140. So, now we will divide both sides by 2. So, 140 by 2. 2 7s are 14 and 0. So, x is equal to 70 degree. That is, the base angle is 70 degree each. One more is there. C. Sachin scored twice as many runs as Rahul. Together their runs fell too short of a double century. How many runs did each one score? So Rahul's and Sachin's score we have to find. So twice as many as Rahul. So let us take x as Rahul's score, Sachin's 2x. Both x plus 2x is equal to 198 because double century is 200. So 2 minus, uh, 200 minus 2 is 198. So we get 3x is equal to 198. Then we will divide by 3. So we get x is equal to 198 by 3. That is equal to 66. Rahul's score is 66 and Sachin's score 66 into 2 that is 132 runs. So this question is finished. Thanks for watching. Please like, share and subscribe my channel.